What's going on, everybody? Trev the Dev here, back with more Isaac. Last time out, we somehow managed to win that run, and we're on a one streak. So, let's see if we can't come around and win another one in a row. Seed for today is L1DWSGNZ. We've got ourselves a Curse of the Labyrinth on the basement. Let's see, I've updated the win counter in the top middle right corner of the screen. I'm not really sure what you would call that area, but that's, uh, that's what I've done. Again, uh, if you're watching this, I uh, just want to mention um, that it is only recorded episodes um, that I've put up starting at around episode 15. Um, so there are a few more losses in there, here and there, but um, generally speaking, that's that's fairly close. I, I don't. It's probably not quite that high, but. I mean, once we keep playing more and more and more, you know, what's uh, what's an extra 20 runs or so? The reason I don't have the first few episodes is I think I, I, I had originally uploaded them to a different YouTube channel and then I accidentally deleted it. Um, so I, I kind of re-uploaded them and I think some of the thumbnails, um, I mis-uploaded them. Not that a ton of people have watched those, of course, but I didn't feel like it was really worth it to go back and, and fix all that good jazz. Cause, I mean, it's not like it's a continual type of game, you know, it's just, uh, everyone is itself, I mean, there are obviously some exceptions, you got a bookworm here, it's very nice, uh, there are some exceptions, yeah, I mean, really, I, I, don't, I don't even know if you call it an exception, but, you know, you, you are looking for, if you're streaking, you know, all the runs are kind of inter interconnected, but in general, each run stands on its own, so, I, I didn't, it's not, it's not a huge deal, it's kind of what I'm getting at, so. Down there. Hoping for another good item in here. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. Host hat. It gives us explosion immunity. Occasional. <sighs> Alright, let's keep it together. <laughs> uh, occasional um, shot blocking capabilities as well. But obviously the explosion immunity is the biggest thing. So I accidentally walked into the uh, fire and took damage like an absolute moron. Hopefully we can still come away with our devil deal. Want to get to the shop, blow up the keeper head, and I'll probably take the Book of Belial into the second uh, boss fight, just in case we get a, a devil deal. Give us a higher chance. Probably secret room's not there, to be honest with you. So let's uh, let's avoid doing that in the future, huh? First, let's avoid dying. I don't think I'll end up dying on this one. Uh, I didn't really mention Aquarius. Um, it's not the best item but you know enemies do tend to rush it down and having the creep is nice i think it might also scale with your damage but i'm not 100 percent sure on that i know there's some creep items i think that do scale with your, da your damage but I, I thought aquarius was but i again i'm not 100 percent sure on that maybe if we get spider mod we can find out let's take care of these fires because fires are my nemesis <laughs> Fires and spikes, man. Fires and spikes. The toughest enemies in the entire game because you just log into them when you're not paying attention. Closely followed by those are little monstrous. <laughs> they're terrible enemies. Uh, they're not terrible, but they're, they're tough to dodge. Again, you gotta stop using that. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely want Humbling Bundle here. Probably don't need to blow him up, but again, I, I do want the additional chance. Uh, we're wasting a little money. I think we had a nickel back there, but um, you know we want the additional chance to take care of the no get into the devil deal. Sorry, I'm trying to think of where my thoughts are going. I, I can't think of it now. Take care of Larry Jr. here. A little dangerous not going in with a, a full charge on our wooden nickel, but there's not really a guarantee that we'd get it anyway. And, we can uh, get uh, Larry Jr. to walk over the creep, then uh, we should be absolutely fine. And then before we fight the second boss, we'll go back and grab the Book of Belial, have the extra Devil Deal chance on the second boss fight. We'll be nice. We'll be nice. We get the box, which could be okay. I'm not safe that it is. So let's go ahead and pop the moon right now. Definitely want to get Odd Mushroom. It's a decent upgrade for us. Yeah. We'll, we'll wait, obviously, until we fight the boss. You know, if we get a one-heart deal, we know that there is Odd Mushroom in the secret room, so we could take that. 
And we got, you know, it's it's more than half. It's more than half. 50, 58 and a half percent. Let's see if there's anything else that I wanted here. Let's probably stick with a tower, I suppose. We could use this to dunk the boss, maybe. We'll see what, uh, we'll see who it is. Might be better served later on. We don't have to worry, again, about the explosions, because we have host hat, so. Uh, we should be fine. I guess I'm not going to risk throwing out the bombs. It's not really a risk, but I think it'll be better served for us uh, on a future future room. So here's hoping for the Devil Deal. Alright, we passed. Very nice, very nice. That is not very nice. We'll, we'll blow these guys up. Why not? Seems like a good, a good uh, use, a use as any. So, might as well take the pills. And then we'll come back this way. Could get that money. I don't think it's going to be critical. But on this tinted rock, see if we. Hey, uh, that's exactly what I was hoping for. It's more tears and more damage. Now, obviously, with this, and we're going to take uh, odd mushroom, fat odd mushroom as well. There's also a slight speed downgrade, but I think it's probably worth it. It's, it's a little touchy because we did drop our speed quite significantly. But, uh, I don't know. I, I tend to think it's probably going to be worth it. Probably have to throw a bomb in the middle of these guys down here. What does this drop us to? 0.55? I don't think there's a huge difference between 0.55 and 0.65, and there's no way we were passing up on small rock anyway, so... All right, hey, look at that. We got ourselves Swallowed Penny. Been a while since I've seen you Swallowed Penny, so obviously that is fantastic for us. Now, do we want to take Book of Belial, or do we want to take the Crooked Penny? I think because we have such low speed and we have Humbling Bundle, um, I think taking Book of Belial probably will be a little bit better. It will give us a higher um, special room spawn chance, uh, Angel or Devil Deal. Um, and then on top of that, it gives us damage, you know, should we should we need it in like a, an emergency situation. Help us, you know, clear a room out a little bit quicker, so. But, uh, could try this pill, just to relax. It's okay with that because if it was a health down, we obviously have this pill that's going to health up. So we'll move on to the next floor. This is a fantastic start, obviously. Let's, uh, let's hope we can pilot it to victory. And we got back to back Curse of the Labyrinth. All right. Kind of. It's uh, not my favorite. Not my favorite. At the very least, we have a very high chance of a devil deal here. Probably go up to around 90 ish percent, I think, once we bomb a keeper, which we probably will do in the shop. Yeah, here, you know, we, can, we can pop this and we can not quite one-shot these guys. Like, yeah, we can we two-shot these guys. I think you have to have like 10 damage to two-shot or one-shot these guys. Don't quote me on that because I don't actually know. This is a easy, fairly easy room for us. I mean, this is a pretty easy room in general. <laughs> Thank you very much, Anub, taking care of the rock. So now we're definitely looking for speed and tears and... Uh, a number of shop items. Take a look in our item room. First item room. Got one mushroom. We get uh, one more. We can get the fun guy transformation, which I don't think does anything for you. I wonder if it gives you the PhD effect. I don't think it does. I don't, I don't think it does. It'd be cool, though. If it, if it were, it'd be a good one. So we could walk on those guys. I don't think it's going to be worth it. Um, maybe I shouldn't even pick that up. You know, left it for a reroll, but I don't know. Who has time for that? Plus, I don't think it's the worst tier effect in the game. It's, it's, it's not a good, it's not what I would classify as a good item, but it's, you know, it moves the needle maybe like one or two percent, which, you know, it's not super significant, but it's, it's not nothing. You know, a bunch of 1%, um, you get like 1% like 10 different times and, you know, you've basically doubled your shot at winning. No, wait, I'm thinking it's 10%. <laughs> Still, you, you get what I'm saying. Golden key, nice. You get 101%, then you're happy. Let's see, a very good damage with Book of Belial. This could be a bit of a tricky room depending on how they're moving, but 
It was not in the end. Just really, 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 really love a speed upgrade. This room is going to be actually a little bit tough. I'm not sure if we can get through here. Okay, we can, just barely, though. Just barely. Tough love. Uh, it's not the worst. This, uh, this would you say this one is a better tier effect than the uh, the God's Flesh. So this will give us a, a tooth shot, which I think does like double or quadruple damage um, based on your luck. So if we can get a, a very high luck stat, which you know there are a number of ways to. I think I'm not, I don't know why I'm bottom those. Um, to break the game with Swallowed Penny playing as a keeper. We'll hope we can find ourselves in one of those situations. Obviously, restock would uh, be the, the number one item on my wish list right now. now. I am recording this on Christmas Eve, so... Game, if you want to throw me a Christmas present, now would be the time. Now would be the time. Try to give me one, and it's Wild Penny. I'm not going not gonna to complain about that. No greed fight. Very nice. Let's go ahead and buy a starter deck. Rather see the cards. Oh, double joker, huh? That's pretty fantastic, honestly. Keep going down this way. Should be the boss room right here. Or fairly close to it. That's uh those are the most dangerous enemies for us right now, the ones that rush us down. That we can't uh take down in more than a couple shots. Because if we don't have high enough damage, then we'll, we'll end up taking like a couple hits. And there's really no guarantee that uh, we can get our money back, even though we do have Swallowed Penny. Should not be too scared of these guys, because then we got Explosion Immunity. These guys, though, these are, these are nasty. That's a dumb hit, but that's okay. We got a Joker card. If we don't pass it here, we can just use that. Uh, there you see the, the really low speed coming into effect. We'll go fight this big horn first. Probably go do some more rooms, I think. And we don't really need to be cautious about the troll bombs. I just know there's a couple that do do contact damage uh, occasionally. I think if he throws up the hot bombs, they will do contact damage. And of course the fire will hurt us, but the, the actual bombs, they, uh, they don't do anything to us, which is very nice. I'm glad to see Bighorn in the first fight. He's uh, one of the tougher tougher bosses you see on this stage, so I'd rather fight somebody else in the second room uh, and have a better shot at actually passing the, the Devil Deal chance, so. Don't like these guys very much. Alright, we're, we're perfectly fine now. We've got a nice tears and shot speed up, which is obviously great. Uh, it's going to be a long and arduous task of coming all the way back over here. But we do these things not because they are easy, but because they are hard. <laughs> I mean, we got to do them. You know, we can't afford to skip out on any special rooms, which, uh, given that we didn't fight Greed in our shop, I'm guessing we probably have a mini boss somewhere on this floor. But also, you know, if there's a mob or a boss trap room, I'd love to get into either of those. Um, an arcade would obviously be fantastic for us. I would love both, or either the ivy bag or the, the blood bag. I'm not sure if I would go with the ivy bag long term. I have to make that decision. Don't like this room very much, to be honest. Then we need to take care of the portal. Now we're fine, now we're fine. Keys there. Not really sure why I came into this room. It's not going to be anything for us, most likely. Well, it could have been like a sacrifice room or something. Sure, we'll, we'll go ahead and pop our bookable island here. Again, we want to make sure we have a, a charge going into the boss. It's not. I don't think it's necessary. We probably would be fine, but I'd rather have the damage than not have the damage, right? Fire these guys down with impunity if they get uh, miniaturized because they don't do contact damage. Take a look in our trap room. Mm, thinking. I don't think I'll get the devil deal um, on this floor. So I'm thinking I might pop those chests open and then pop the joker card. Let's see what this one is here. 
Mace of Diamonds. Nah. I think we'll do that. I think we'll I think we'll pop in here. Crack open these bad boys. A luck upgrade right now. Three luck upgrades. Holy cow. <laughs> I don't even know that could happen. Uh, then we'll just pop the Joker card. Joker. Well, I would love to take a lot, any of these, but uh, we can't really. But man, what a... I don't know if I've ever seen three lucky pennies out of... I, I don't think that might have been out of two chests. It, I don't know if it was out of one chest or two chests, but that is honestly ridiculously good luck. But, uh, it's going to make our tough love that much better. Going to fire more and more shots. And having more luck is, you know, just generally pretty good. Especially as we continue on. More consumables. You know, we get other tier effects, which we would probably expect to get, like, maybe one or two more. But it is, it is a little unfortunate. Um, if we do get an HP upgrade from this boss, I think we would probably go back into the double deal and pick up Sacrificial Dagger. Just because it's so good. Like, it's, it's ridiculous. Ridiculously good. Um, but I guess we'll have to see. Aren't we uh, fight in the hollow. Hollow should be easy enough as long as we are smart with our positioning and dodging. And they, they don't even run into each other, which is okay. Well, we were not smart with our positioning and dodging. We got uh, hemmed into the corner. Which I uh, figured was going to happen. All right. All right. You got to pull it back. So, uh, see, our low speed is making us a little difficult. So, no devil deal. Or no uh, HP upgrade, rather. So. We'll just uh, we'll hold on to the Joker card for the next floor and head on down. Head on down. Acropolis 1, we got a guaranteed Devil Deal here, which is nice. I'm assuming we don't take damage, which... I don't know. Our low speed is probably going to cause us to take a hit or two. Luckily, of course, we've got our... You know what? This, uh, this room paid out well for me last time. Let's try it again. Strength card, which is pretty good. We'll hold on to that. Might as well pop our Buckle Belial. Um, obviously, strength and Joker with uh, the Keeper is pretty good. This will allow us to potentially get into a Devil Deal, and then we could take it, use the Strength card, get our HP back permanently. But I want to wait until we fight the boss, probably. Yeah, before doing that. Just in case we, we get uh, like an HP upgrade. Hey, hey, thank you very much. See, Host Hat, we are, we, we're going to take damage, but Host Hat said, nope, I got you, bro. He uh, reflected the shot. He caught reflecting the shot, but he uh, he took the he took the hit for us and, and fired a, a triple shot, as you see the, the regular hosts do. Saved us from damage, so I appreciate that. Appreciate Host Hat. Shouts out. Great item. I, I like it. It's a fantastic item, even. Anytime you get explosion immunity, I mean, <laughs> holy cow, that's, that's really, really powerful. I'm watching that spider because I'm assuming this is going to jump down. Did not. It's very kind of you. Go ahead and throw here and get, check out this card. Should probably take care of that guy, but yeah, we'll, we'll get him on the, on the way around. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, see, no problem, no problem. World card is nice. We'll pop into our shop before we go into our item room, of course. Our shortcut through here. Very nice. We got a greed fight, so no greed in our shop. We'd love a steam sale here if you'd be willing game. I would, I would, I would be appreciative of that. And who knows? You know, we get like a diplopia or a crooked penny in the shop. Infinite money. And we did get steam sale. So now it's just a matter of do we have something in our shop that uh, we can. Use that. I think there should be. I was expecting wall spiders here. There's not. This is a. This this room kind of stinks for us because of our low speed. But luckily, we, we got high enough damage that you know our low speed isn't a huge deal right now. But it, it will be uh, starting soon. So I don't want either of those. Looking for probably a restock is what I would be looking. Hey, there you go. Look at that. All right. So restock now um, because we have. I'm just gonna pop the chariot. We don't need that. Yeah, because we have basically infinite money, thanks to having Swallowed Penny and Humbling Bundle, we can hurt ourselves in uh, any number of locations. We could buy that, but eh. Right, we got Sharp Plug as well, which I definitely think we should take. Look at that. 
All right. So now the goal is to buy Diplopia, and then this run will be broken. <clears throat> broken indeed. Because then we have double Steam Sale restock, and Bob is your uncle. Let's, uh, obviously, the game has no shot of winning against us at that point. So, I don't know. I'd rather, I think, it, well, I guess it, it doesn't really matter, does it, if we hold on to our devil deal? Probably not, huh? I still want to die like an idiot, you know? See if we can get some money or something first. I'd rather just get the money naturally. Uh, as opposed to hitting ourselves in various means. So we'll, uh, we'll, clear, we'll clear, clear a few rooms here. Again, we cannot really afford to take damage. That would be terrible for us. If we do take damage, we got to pick it up. So <sighs> This guy, man, he is some kind of a threat. Alright, 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 I don't know. I, I, I guess we took damage. We should go just, uh, you know, farm some money real quick. As long as we do, you know, then it's uh, it's GG. But we gotta have a place to do it because we can't bomb ourselves because we have host at. Let's do some fires here. Indeed, there were. We'll do it this way. Oops. Always gotta make sure I have at least one coin heart filled. They're both, uh, both coin hearts filled. So I'm just being extra, extra careful. Mm. Alright. I'm going to blow these up so I don't walk into them. Because <laughs> I know I will. We'll buy a Diplopia. And we'll come back here. And we'll get our double steam sale. And we'll win the game. You always love to see a break, man. You always love to see a break. So uh, Obviously, everything is free for eternity. I don't know really why I'm buying all this stuff. World card? Yeah. We'll hold on to what we got. Love keeping the strength cards. We get that. Portable slot. Get placebo. Just got to make sure I don't double tap the space bar because, again, I do have um, sharp plug. So I just got to be careful with that. Two spades, just go ahead and pop that. Box of friends, how you doing? Punch your fingers, the jar. There's a speed upgrade and stopwatch, which is awesome. Bottle of pills, just gives us cards because we have, what's it called? Got blue map, King Babby. Broken modem, how you doing? Cricket smelter, uh, yeah, we'll definitely take that. So like here we can tap this and then we can pick up money and smelt trinkets. Uh, we don't really have a way to farm them right now, but I'm sure we will get one. Coupon. We got various options. We got a 9 volt, so now we can't use sharp plug, so kind of disappointing, but uh, I, I definitely think getting the items is better than not getting the items right now. Jackhead. Now let's go ahead and pop this while we get. Well, neither, of these, neither of these do anything for us, do they? Why am I doing this? I don't know. Probably a bad idea. Because if we die, then we look like an idiot. But I suppose I want my angel items in the future. Uh, I guess we'll take scapular, because why not? Why not? Spider mod. Let me keep going here. Spider mod. Soul converter. Or just regular converter. I thought it was called Soul Converter. Champion Belt. Uh, black Candle. Very good. PHD. How you doing? Doesn't do much for us. Because <laughs> we have cards instead of pills. Alright, Glowing Hourglass. Fantastic, obviously. Habit. Got the ladder. El Ladderino. Deep Pockets. Uh, boomerang. With a gift. We got Backpack, which is awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and use this here. The poop. Fantastic. Yep. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's keep going here. We got a school bag. Obviously great. Pandora's box. We just go ahead and pop that. Let's get the flies out. My mega, sure. I do want to call it an hourglass. It's probably what I'm going to go with that, and uh, hopefully we get... Uh, 
you know the combo that we want. Ah, I've said it before. Hopefully, hopefully we get the combo. Crooked Penny. Little baggy. This does turn everything back into pills. Okay. Wasn't sure if it did. The compass. We got mom's key. We got more options. We got buddy in a box. Is this key eggs one? Oh yeah, necropolis one. Still got another floor, so if we see something bad here, then we can we can keep moving. There's a, probably an item. You know, we'll see what else we get here. Obviously fantastic. I don't want this really. It's not terrible for us because we have explosion immunity, but I'd rather just not deal with it. Let's, uh, let's get this out of our inventory real quick. Yeah. That, you know, it, it's not bad, but I don't, I'd rather just not deal with it. Uh, we could try to blank card this stuff, you know, re-roll it and whatnot. I think I'll pass for the moment. There we go. We got Cricket Penny. How about that? Blankets. Yeah, we got Potato Peeler. Let's, uh, do we want to get Chaos right now? I don't think so. So we'll hold on to these two bad boys. Uh, let's try to re-roll. Percano. And no secondary. Um. Uh, ruin out of that. This uh, this just gives us cards, right? Of diamonds. I'm wondering if it gives us um. Two of clubs. Yeah, I think this is gonna just give us cards. I don't think it'll give us runes. I, I was thinking about maybe if it if it give us some runes or something. So, get uh, Mama Megan now. She's uh, sorry about the visual effect. We're a little bit photosensitive. So let's do it. So now we got our combo, man. We got our combo. We got the bloat. How you doing, bloat? Yeah, hey, bloat's dead. Uh, let's see. Do we want to try to get more tears ups? I suppose we should. All right. How about that? I think uh, four of them is probably good enough for me. Maybe we could have got more. I don't know. But that's a nice tears up, and we'll move on. Definitely do a victory lap on this time, I think. Because you gotta love the broken runs. You gotta love the broken runs. Pause this for a second here. Nah, we're probably fine. Hopefully I'm recording. Let me pause something. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I don't know. <laughs> I don't really have a preview window open. So I'm, I'm hoping that it is recording. Hoping that it is recording. Don't want to take damage, though. Don't want to take damage. So, you know, I, I don't really know if there's much to say about what we've got going on here. Probably yeah, a mini-boss fight, if I'm guessing. No? How about that? Oh, and we get the battery, which is awesome. Mm, still want, still don't really want chaos right now. Take the nightlight. I guess, I don't know, there's not really anything else that I'm, I'm thinking that we need, so I guess we probably should take it. Well, we're through shop items anyways. So we got Lack Veggie, which is interesting. Always interesting. Don't want either of those. I'm just re-rolling right now. Sure, we'll take Sulfuric Acid. I guess we'll take a Shoop de Boop. So that breaks the Tears Cap. Yeah, Euthanasia, Stompy. No, nope, almost picked that one up. Of course, we got Going Our Glass, so it would it would have been fine, it would have been fine. Cancer for bag. Ghost baby. How you doing, ghost baby? Oh, we could have had the infinite combo, huh? Oh, sure. Uh, I always love a bloody bus. Or bloody blood. Bloody bus. Oh, yeah. Uh, dead, dead eyes. Very good. Uh, sticky bombs. Don't really want Dr. Fetus. Uh, it's probably a mistake, but let's pick it up. Because why not? Pray God. No chubby. Mm, let's, uh, let's pass on Monstro's Lung. So let's go back to our item room. Curious to see what our shots are going to I got to pause for a second again. Sorry about this. All right, we're, we're back. Sorry. Ho hopefully hopefully that, that whole first half of the episode is recording. I I think it should be, but I don't know. Now we got a uh, lack of hedging and, and uh, all this good stuff. It's going gonna, it's gonna to get a little funky. It's going to get a little funky. But I like lack of hedging. It's an underrated item in my opinion. Does some, some weird stuff. 
<laughs> like this. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's what Activate can do for you. Not really sure what's going on though. It killed the enemy apparently. Uh, you know what? Pop's gonna make this even weirder. Yeah, this will this will get this will get real funky. It's gonna get real funky real fast. I love that this Gaper would stop doing this because he's getting quite annoying. <laughs> You know what, host? We'll just walk on you then. If you don't want to pop up, we'll just walk on you. Let's see, birth room, ancestor room. Alright, that's fine. So, uh, well, you know what game came through? He came through for me. I asked for a Christmas present, and you gave me a Christmas present in the form of double steam sale restock. And, uh, yeah, if I didn't read out the seed, no, I definitely read out the seed. So, there's a seed if you want to play this one for sure. Um, I don't know. This, uh, this kind of. To me, this kind of shows why I think Keeper is one of the one of, if not the easiest character to break the game as. Probably, eh, Isaac is probably a little bit easier, maybe then Apollyon as well. But uh, the Keeper is just super, super easy to break the game as. Um, we're doing a victory lap. We're doing a victory lap. Ooh, what do we take here? Do we take Crown of Light or do we take Angelic Prism? They're both great. I think I'm going to take Angelic Prism just because of the number of tiers we're throwing out here. I could have tried for the... Actually, you know, let's do that. No. Nope. Well, I'm an idiot. I thought uh, I thought that was going to work. And it didn't. Oh, well. We could probably get it next time, right? I wanted to get that just because of the number of tiers we were firing out there, but uh, I guess I'm an idiot, so... Yeah, just, just take that, I guess, huh? Just take that. <laughs> I don't know. Crown of Light is obviously a two times damage multiplier, but uh, Angelic Prism, you know, with all the tiers that we got going on the screen right now, that would have been, been pretty great as well. <laughs> you see the, the tier interactions between Alakophagy and Pop and all the other stuff we got going on right now. Got too many tiers flying around in uh, <laughs> not very much space. It's a great combo. <laughs> Avert your eyes, man. If uh, you're photosensitive, though. And I still don't think we've actually lost our dead dead shot, dead eye, since we've uh, started racking up the bonus. Uh, not 100% uh, not sure what was going on with that one tier. It was just kind of spinning in space. Yeah, like that. I'm not really sure what, uh, what's going on with some of these tiers. But I like it. I like it indeed. You know, I just I could just use the two the speed upgrade. We'll move on. We'll move on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Boss fight over here. It's very nice having black candle and permanent mapping. Still, still need a little bit more. I mean, I don't think we're gonna die, but you know, we could take a couple hits back to back and and find ourselves, uh, you know, eating it on this run. Which would be terrible, terrible, terrible. Of course, we got we'll go fight uh, the mini boss. Why not? Envy does not stand a chance. This is just me just firing, you know, rapidly, and then could uh, could use a higher tiers rate just uh, just to see kind of what uh, other interactions we can uh, we can make with this. I love uh, Brimstone. Brimstone and Black Veggie is bizarre. <laughs> it is something something crazy. Are you kidding me? What the? Mm, what happened? Oh my goodness gracious! What an unfortunate way to lose! I don't know what happened. I thought I picked up the money. Ah, uh, well, we would have won that run, but uh, I guess I walked into a polyp. That's a that's a dumb way to do it. It's a dumb way to end this one. So. You know what, hopefully, you know, if, if you guys want to play a broken one, fire that one up and, and try to pilot it to victory like uh, I couldn't do because I'm an idiot, apparently. Well, if you enjoyed it, you know, if you, if you want to leave a like, comment, or subscription, I, I would appreciate it. Otherwise, we'll see you all in the next video. See ya.